my name is Gavin. And my name is Juno, and welcome to Panther News. Congratulations to your MHS debate team for their success this past weekend at Kaufman High School Debate and Speech Tournament. Joseph Sires, Trevor Toby Place, and David Salazar are all taking home placements in their accomplishments. Great job. FCCLA will be hosting our annual Thanksgiving canned food drive for Manor House next week, November 5th through the 9th. Students can donate up to 20 cans total and earn one hour community service per 10 cans. Students can turn cans into their first period teacher or Mrs. Walker in room 712. The first period to collect the most cans will win a prize. Due to weather, In-N-Out Burger Truck has been moved again to November 6th. Tickets are still available for $5 and you will get a burger, chips, and a drink. You can still get these tickets from any debate team member, Ms. Bogey, Ms. Salazar, Ms. Gaither, Ms. Rollins, Ms. Humphreys, or Trainer Wagner. Avid is selling popcorn for $3 a bag or two bags for $5. Flavors include salsa, white cheddar, vanilla, and caramel. See Mrs. Neef, Ms. Foreman, Coach Johnson, or Mrs. Gaither to purchase and support Avid. Seniors, it's time for your parents to pull out your most embarrassing baby pictures and compile them into a collage for your senior yearbook ad. Where am I? Show your work now. You tried to buy the yearbook at a discounted price, didn't you? As for me, I'm here because I tried to buy a senior ad that is currently $290, but I only had $1. You can also buy a senior ad. One eighth of the page is $65, one fourth of the page is $120, one half of the page is $160, and the full page is $290. Senior ads are due by Friday, November 9th. Parrots can purchase them through Jossens.com. See Ms. Vondren in room 173 if you have any questions. HOSA is once again collecting socks for a senior citizen center in Cedar Hill for Thanksgiving. If you would like to donate some socks, please bring them to Ms. Salazar in Lab 1. For the entire month of November, HOSA will be collecting change to donate to the National Pediatric Cancer Foundation. Their main goal is to help with cancer research and pediatric cancer patients. Jars for the donations will be located in various classrooms, so look for one and help be a part of the change. Student Council will be selling No Shave November passes during lunch throughout the whole month of November. The pass is $10 and must be displayed with your ID badge. All the funds raised go to support cancer research. Today is the last day to purchase your yearbook at the price of $65. Prices will go up tomorrow. Visit jossens.com to order or see Ms. Fondren in room 173. Orders will be accepted online until midnight tonight. The question of the day is, the Maya of Mesoamerica are best known for their achievements in A, shipbuilding and navigation, B, carpentry, C, mathematics and astronomy, or D, literature. And the trivia question of the day is, what movie did Tom Hanks first win an Oscar for? A, Philadelphia, B, Forrest Gump, C, Saving Private Ryan, or D, Castaway? Now to Chris with sports. Tuesday night, the Panther volleyball team defeated Mesquite Petite in the Bide District playoff match in three straight sets. The Panthers are now 27-12 on the season. They will compete in the next round of playoffs tonight against Texacana High at the Robert E. Lee High School. Game starts at 7 o'clock. Girls basketball will be playing their home opener this Friday against Mansfield High School. Freshman and JV tip-off at 5 p.m., varsity at 6.30 p.m. Come out and support our Lady Panthers. Are you interested in playing soccer but not in the soccer class? Please see Coach Guest in room 604 during advisory by next Thursday for information on tryouts. The JV Panthers ended their season last night with a great 46-6 win over Cleburne. The offense was led by Dawson White, Jake Peters, David Smith, Darren Greeson, and the offensive line. Defensively, Christian Navarro had an interception along with a great sack by Jalen Palmer. The entire defense played well, only allowing six points. The JV Panthers ended the season of a winning record of 6-3-1. to to one. Congratulations on a great season. Our varsity football team took the, home the W last night against Burleson in their pink out game. The Panthers played strong throughout the game to plan and to keep the momentum for their game tonight. They will play the Cleburne Yellow Jackets tonight at Cleburne at 7.30. A win tonight will guarantee our Panthers a great spot in the playoffs. Back to you at the news desk. 
The answer to the question of the day is C, mathematics and astronomy. And the answer to the trivia question is A, Philadelphia. Thanks for tuning in today. We hope to see you next time. And as always, go to and go Panthers.